Hello dudes, it's me Lance 10 here, back with another Windcraft quest guide. Today we are going to take a look at the quest called Tempo Town Trouble. It's a combat level minimum of 25. It's a medium length quest. Talk to Tycho at those coordinates. We're gonna right click to track it. We're gonna start in Nemract here, and for the sake of the uh, for the sake of easiness. Uh, throughout the quest, I'm going to also bring along a Ragni scroll. You can, of course, walk to Ragni or buy a scroll over at the scroll merchant. But anyways, we're starting in Nemract, and Tycho, the starting dude for the quest, is right here outside the bank. Okay, let's do this. Hello? Excuse me, can anyone here help me? Anyone? Oh, hey human. Come over here. Yes, yes, right, right over here. Listen up real quick for me, yeah? You're just the right kind of guy I need. All right, my name is Tycho, and me and my town could really use help here, okay? So, I'm from a place, a place called Tempo Town. It's near the Time Valley on that ridge overlooking a big cluster of ruins. You know the place? So, uh, some old man comes by and tells us to set up there. Yes, he also tells us about the dan uh, uh, about the dangers of living in the valley itself, and that's where our problems begin. All of this mess started when one night some strange creature came by town and started ravaging everything in sight without warning. And now it's been regularly attacking us almost uh, every damn day. We can't bear to deal with it, with it any longer. Now, despite the old guy getting us into this mess by saying that ridge was safe, he's too stubborn about uh, letting us go inside the actual damn place uh, this thing is coming from. So, that's where I need you to come in and help. Do you feel me? We'll need uh, you out, uh, out of a bit uh, if you... Uh, We'll help you out a bit if you, uh, if you help us out, alright? Now, I need you to head uh, to the mayor of the town and talk to him. He'll tell you everything that you'll need to know. Don't worry about that. Oh, and before you go, stay the hell away from that old man. If he spots you, he'll just end up being a thorn in your side for the entire job. Alright, I think that's everything. Off you go. Okay, we're gonna shift through. So, uh, so the quest is started. Now we're gonna head over to Ragni using a scroll, just to make the traveling less, uh, uh, less and shorter. I'm gonna give myself some walk speed bonus here, and uh, we're just gonna head to Tempo Town. Now, if we uh, restart the quest tracking. There we go. We have a marker over at Tempo Town. We're gonna exit Ragni here to the uh, east, and we're gonna continue uh, along this road until we get to the border of the Nivla Forest. Okay, once here, we're just gonna go this way. We're gonna take a right and continue along the edge of the Nivla Forest. Okay. And here, we'll find a new road. And we'll follow this one. Now we can already see, of course, the general direction of Tempo Town. But we're just gonna follow the roads um, here at this intersection we're gonna continue to the right here and we're gonna follow along this path across the bridge and follow the road and here at this intersection we're gonna uh, 
go off to the left here. And here we're going to take this path downwards. Here we are. And here is Tempo Town. Okay. And here is the homeless mayor. Hello there. Welcome to the recently made Tempo Town, friend. While we may not be an official town here, we shall still try to assure your stay here is all the more enjoyable. Repeat that. Tycho sent Tycho sent you? Thank Rook. I'm so glad you're here, soldier. My poor little town has been in so much danger due to these horrible monsters. Please listen carefully, I can't risk you failing. I don't want to lose this little town I've been building here. So every night the same monster emerges from the ruins. And it comes here, on the dot. It's so horrible. We've been attacked almost every night by this freak of nature. One of our scouts believes uh, they found the location of it too. Here, here, let me write the location down for you. No, no, don't worry, let me do it, let me do it. Alright, there's the location. Please head there and take care of it as soon as you can. My poor little tempo town is counting on you. Okay. And now we're gonna go back up here. Gonna need some new walk speed here. And we're gonna go up here and we can see the ruins right off here to the north on the other side of the road. And here is the scout, Doug the Scout, that we need to talk to. Uh, I know I saw that beast go in there. Where the hell is it? Hey soldier, does that disc look so like some type of door to you? I saw some creature that I've been tracking for a few days disappear around here, and I think it's somewhere behind that disc. But there's probably some kind of wacky magic keeping it shut since I can't get it open at all. Hey, you're able to use magic, right? Maybe using one of your uh, fancy spells on the disc will uh, get it open. Stand on the disc and cast any spell. That should probably get it open. Then we can finally kill that freak of nature lurking inside of there. Okay, so we're gonna stand on here and we're just gonna cast three spells here. And there we go. Now we're down in here. Now there's going to be some fighting up ahead. You might need some potions. And uh, if you die, uh, no worries. Just head back to the ruin and do the spells and you can re-enter. We're just going to go through here. Okay. Here we are. Go down the staircase. And we can see this time trouble thing in the middle here. That's... The uh, monster that we need to uh, fight. Obviously, the fight is a bit easier for me because I'm high level. What was going through your noggin, Alinus? You need to be careful. Oh, wait. No, 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 no. I... Now the previous message disappeared. Dang it. All right. He said, Do you have any idea what you were doing bashing that? Uh, bashing around that room I just sealed off for good. You need to be careful, soldier. This valley's secret are not to be meddled with. I assume the mayor of that place called the Tempo Town sent you here. You're gonna have to tell that lad that his problems just got worse. The monster you just killed was known as a Time Trouble. They're odd creatures that were forced into a day-long temporal... Temporal loop by some fools long ago the only way to keep them at bay effectively is to seal them just like i did here but now that stunt you just pulled sent ripples across the entire valley now every single time trouble is responding to this one's termination oh no now one time trouble i can handle but this i can't keep them all at bay and now you went off and awakened every single one of those critters. I can fix this seal, so you'll have to uh, 
uh, so you'll have less to deal with, but the rest of the time troubles will have to be taken down daily with brute force. You're going to have to deal with those, soldier. Um, I have far too much to take care of in this valley already. I'll have uh, to be exterminated every single day. Now, I'm sure they, uh, the work won't be thankless. Perhaps you'll be rewarded by the town folk of Tempo Town for taking care of them. Now, please be careful in the valley. I have already... Uh, I already have to look after one person. Never mind the mess of that... Uh, mess of the time that the Ulm were so... I dig digress. Um, I'm just rambling on again. Now, let me bring us back outside this temple and you should head back to that shanty town. Alright. And we're teleported. And now we're just gonna go back to Tempo Town and talk to the mayor. We also have this time fragment now. Okay, here we are. Let's talk to the mayor. Hello there. Welcome to the recently. Is the monster dead? Did you kill it? Oh, that's anno that annoying old man named Martin saw you. That's a bit of an issue, I suppose. He's one. He's uh, the one who's been keeping us from dealing with it for so long. He keeps on saying he'll deal with the issue, but then ends put uh, ends up putting it off. Wait, what? Okay, let me get this straight. Those things are stuck in time. Martin had the seal on them, and you broke it. And now there's more of them. Ah, damn it, soldier! Now they're gonna they're not, now they're going to be need to be stopped every day to keep them in check. Hold on, that time fragment you have, did the monster you killed drop of it? Interesting, hey, that reminds me. One of the town folks like to collect those things. He's uh, that mysterious merchant just behind me. Go talk to him about those. He might give you something worth your while if you trade them with him. Alright, I think that's it, soldier. Uh... Wait, Tycho said there was a reward? Of course not. Do you really think I have any money? Now off you go. Thanks for saving my town, I guess. And there we go. Quest completed. 5,650 experience points, one time fragment, and access to the Time Valley Time Trouble bosses. Now, the time fragment and also the other time monsters, they will drop more of those. You can go to the Mysterious Merchant and you can buy several uh, different kinds of items here uh obviously they cost more than just oh wait <laughs> these ones only cost one but yeah if you want to find more time bosses to fight there are a few ones uh in uh, kind of every single ruin um there's one over in that ruin over there there's one over in that ruin the, the time boss only spawns in like center and like in the center of that and yeah, there's one even and then there's one in this larger ruin up over there those are the ones I know of so far but there could be more anyways that was it for this quest guide I hope you guys all enjoyed this video make sure to leave a like and a comment down below I'll see you guys in the next one goodbye